God opens the mouth of the donkey like we say before davening. God, open my mouth. Unzipper my lips. Let my mouth utter your praise. I don't want to talk. I want you to open up my mouth. I want my mouth to be a channel for your light, for your love, for your hope. What an incredible introduction. Every time we dive in, why do you need God to open your lips? I mean, you always need Him. But our lips open up by nature. It's an extraordinary meditation before I open my mouth, before anybody opens their mouth to speak, before you speak to your child, especially your teenage child, before you speak to your spouse, before you speak to anybody, before you're about to give a speech, before you're about to give a serious presentation, especially if it's maybe harsh or tough, before I pray, God, open up my mouth. Will you unzipper my lips? I want my lips to be a channel for your love. And if you're not ready for that, if God doesn't open your lips, then stay quiet. So Rabbi Avadia Sifarno uses this verse to describe what happens here. God opens the mouth of the donkey. The donkey is now a channel in order to teach Bilam what he could become. Look, this donkey reinvented himself completely. He became a channel for God's words. Donkeys can't talk, but God can make them talk or can talk through them. The